Hello there my friend and welcome back. It is Monday and we have a brand new Sigil campaign map to get ourselves into and we're supposed to have a new Dragon Board event but uh, it seems like Windows users just do not have the event right now because we don't have the update meaning that currently the Breeding Blitz event is impossible for those that don't already have Bamboo. I guess that is a complaint for another day. So we did finish the previous Sigil campaign map, which means that the difficulty will be scaled on this version of the map to be, you know, slightly more difficult than it was last time. And the reward for completing this Sigil campaign map this month is going to be the QT Sea Slug Dragon. And he is an epic with metal, water and shadow elements. So an interesting typing and a weird design for a dragon overall with the final boss being that rat dragon right at the end there so um we will be taking on these four fights in a second like i said we are supposed to have a dragon board event right now but because we don't have the update on windows it's just not appearing i even got a pop-up in game clicked it and the game just crashed but we do have a breeding blitz event for Gemini Alpha and the Dragon Board event is supposed to give us the opportunity to get the Bamboo Dragon but obviously that's not possible. Luckily for me I do already have a Bamboo Dragon and a Mercury Dragon so I'm okay with that but you gotta feel for the people that don't already have the Dragon available but if you do have those two Dragons when you breed them together you've got just under a 4% chance of breeding Gemini Alpha and with three days you know, it's not a very long time period, so best of luck to you, but you can see all of this on the DML Planner website. So, of course, along with that, we've also got the new bottomless dungeon, with the main reward dragon being the royal dragon, the cute little blue dragon. And in the dungeon shop, we've got a premium sigil chest, which I am definitely going to take before we take on this uh, new searching of the sigil campaign map. Wow, no rares. Feels bad, dude. Feels very bad, dude. Wow, I was hoping for at least one there. <laughs> ah, screw me, right? Either way, we've got that. The Track Dragon pieces for Apocalypse, if anyone wants them. We've got Boss Habitats, a VIP ticket, which I'm going to buy. And food and portal gems. All the other stuff's kind of meh. Boss Habitat, not useful for me since I don't have any Boss Dragons, apart from one. So, um... Yeah, main thing with this dungeon is going to be hoping that we get the royal dragon that's just going to pop out out of one of these random chests. You know, if you want to be nice to me, gang, you can go ahead and do that. I am not going to complain, but it's unlikely that you're going to get the dragon unless it's out of the final purple chest. So, um, yeah, good luck this week with getting everything that you can. And let's hope that Windows actually does get their update soon, but I'm not sure what's going to happen regarding this Dragon Board event, to be honest with you. Just seems like it's um, not doable, and I've reset the game multiple times. It's just not here for Windows, so um, sucks to be us, right? Anyway, like I said, we are going to um, got Rebirth, Havoc, and Subdue. I don't want any of those as rares. Anyway, let's take on the uh, beginning of this new Sigil campaign map. And what they did last time was they just reused the end part of the map in the first half of this part of the map and I'm gonna assume that they're probably gonna do the same thing again here so we shouldn't run into any issues but the main thing that people have been wondering is are we gonna end up facing legendary sigils now because you can see I'm still using uncommon sigils on most of my dragons so if we start running into legendary it might become a little bit difficult and people have been saying, you can buy the premium sigil chest. It's like, yeah, I've been buying some. It's just, if you don't get lucky with the sigils that you want, mainly Purity and Daredevil for me, that's it, you're kind of screwed. <laughs> and there's nothing that you can do to change the RNG drops that you're going to get given. So um, you just got to hope and pray. It's pretty much like everything in this game. It's just hoping and praying. Um, not that that really does as much good sometimes, but hey -o! Uh, we do also have a post on the DML Facebook page that has posted that picture of what I believe to be oh Sigil Slayer, that Chrono Poseidon armor. But they're saying that we've got to post a set amount of pictures of which divines we want to get chronified, and then they're going to reveal the new dragons to us. 
So, um, if you want to see the new dragons, I highly recommend you check out that Facebook post. But, um, I am curious to see what people want to get chronified the most. Of course, my favourite would be a god ceremony. But, some people have been saying Freya. Imagine Chrono Freya, Chrono Hathor. Ugh, sounds disgusting. Anyway, like you just saw, those first four map fights were not a struggle with the sigils that I've been using. But I am very curious to see if we are going to start running into any legendary ones later on. So I guess you'll find out in like the next five days or so. Or maybe just after the five days. Whether we're going to get screwed over by um, these sigils getting upgraded or not. So um, yeah, apart from that not too much is going on. Of course we've got clan events like we do every single week. Because why would we not always have clan events going on? At least, considering we've got an entire Dragon Board event that's just not going to work. Um, at least we've got something to keep us occupied in the meantime. Um, but honestly, considering that we know that the Divine event is very, very close to starting, I am worried now that if we don't get this Dragon Board event like straight away, like within the next hour or so, that we're just not going to get the event whatsoever. Um, which would feel pretty bad. I don't know if we've ever actually had that happen before on Windows. Which really does feel like we have been forgotten this time. Thank you, Microsoft. Um, they keep saying it's some sort of delay with the update going through, but I don't know how accurate that is. I've heard before that Microsoft have said that it's not their fault, and then Gameloft said it's not their fault, so whose fault actually is it? I don't know. But, hey yo, for now, I guess we'll just enjoy nothing in replacement for missing out on that. Um, again, I think the main thing that was annoying was the fact that I legitimately got an in-game pop-up for the event. But if you click it, it just crashed my game. I'm pretty sure they said to us on the forums that it, it, even if we didn't have the update, it wouldn't matter for the event. But clearly it does. Clearly it does. Um, so I'm just going to refresh all these because these quests suck and I don't want to have to do those. So wait another two hours for that. Let's collect all of our food. And we did get a few more promotions in the shop now because obviously it is Monday. They change most Mondays at the same time. But nothing too impressive. I mean there's still a bundle for the general up there. And there is a bundle where you can just outright buy the Gemini Alpha. But it's 25 quid. 25 quid? That's really not worth it. Really not worth it. You know what? Maybe I should just go for a breed. Screw it. Might as well do something, right? So, um... Oh yeah, that's another horror dragon, by the way. Whoopsie doozy. So, let's look at this bamboo and mercury dragon combo. Again, most of my dragons are at level 30 now. But you can see that we own all of these dragons. And there's the Gemini egg breed. What do we get? Nothing of value, as predicted, but that is just the way that the cookie crumbles. So, um, for now, I guess the main thing to be keeping note of, again, is going to be the DML Facebook page, because they're going to be posting more of this stuff about the Chrono Dragons, and again, they said in this post, post a screenshot in the comments of the Divine Dragon in your collection that you'd most like to have chronified if we receive 500 of these posts will reveal the new Chrono Dragons tomorrow. So, I highly recommend you spam this post with, it doesn't matter the quality of the photo as long as it's in there, just spam the post with the dragons that you want to see chronified, and then hopefully we will see all of those new Chrono Dragons tomorrow, which um, I'm very, very antsy to see what they are. Apollo, are you coming? Are you not? Don't let me down. Um, and will they reveal absolutely everything? Or are they only going to reveal the Chrono Dragons tomorrow? Because even if they reveal the Chrono Dragons tomorrow, that doesn't mean that they're going to tell us all of the Divines that are going to be coming back. Which is interesting, but... Will we see that Chrono Ultimate Dragon that we've been speculating about as well? I guess we will find out in due course. Um, but Game Loft, in the meantime, if you do want to give us an actual event, that would be fantastic. Um, I do feel bad for the people that are really desperate for Gemini Alpha. 
but there's no way for them to get bamboo, so um, good luck if you're in that boat. Um, I do hope that this gets fixed. Wonderful. Anyway, for now, thank you for joining me, and until next time, I do hope that I can see you then.